I do about six to 10,000 calories per day. Eight massive meals in just one day, over 8,000 calories per meal. What in the world? Ugh. I can't, I just can't. Mm. I'll do about 60% of straight protein chicken, four whole chickens. We have a whole chicken, a whole chicken snack. Whole chicken. 24 boiled eggs. 20 egg whites. A protein shake. My shakes are considered a meal. They have Greek yogurt, filled up with blueberries, banana, quinoa. There's quinoa in the smoothie, quinoa. Oh my God, I'm so scared. Oh. Peanut butter sandwich. Oh, oh. wow. I have salmon. I kind of make the rock look like one of the kids eating a, a school meal <laughs> compared to what I eat. I eat three to four chickens a day. I eat a lot, he said. There's literally no effort to get to 6,000 calories, he said. There's no such thing as a cheat meal to me, Rush said. What's going on, everyone? It's Cecile Suede, and in this video, I'm gonna be attempting White House chef Andre Rush's insane 1,200 gram protein diet. So I was surfing the web at around one in the morning of the night, and I saw that Will Tennyson uploaded a video where he tried his insane daily routine, and I was thinking, Will, why would you do that? Then I stumbled upon a video of Loaded by Men's Health, where Chef Andre Rush showcased his daily diet plan. Chef Andre Rush, everybody knows me as a White House chef, and I'm gonna take you through a day in the life of my diet and what it takes for me to maintain my physical physique and training with my lifestyle. So come on and check it out. which consisted of around 6,000 to 10,000 calories. I do about six to 10,000 calories per day. Coming from 60% protein. I'll do about 60% of straight protein. 20% fats. I'll do 20 of those good fats. And 20% carbs. And then I'll do 20 of carbohydrates. Which is crazy. I do a 60-20 tour. Considering he also only sleeps around two hours a night. My morning starts at 3 a.m every morning, 12 o'clock midnight, I am going to finish off that other half of chicken. With that being said, I am going to be attempting all natural White House chef, Chef Andre's daily diet plan. So wish me luck and make sure you smash the like button on this YouTube video if you like to see me suffer. And then after you give the video a like, let me know in the comment section down below what other insane daily diets, workouts, or routines you'd like me to follow in the future. But with that being said, let's get to the grocery store, pick up some foods. This is insane. A whole oven roasted chicken. Another whole chicken. Three whole chickens. So y'all know I love to take on a big challenge when it comes to my YouTube channel, but this is next level. I mean, meal number one in White House Chef Andre Rush's diet plan is gonna consist of 20 egg whites, four whole eggs, a cup of kale, a cup of oatmeal with two tablespoons of peanut butter, and then just a cup of coffee. I cannot believe this man eats 20 egg whites. Who in the world eats 20 egg whites? This hardly fits in the plate, and let it be known that this is actually so much harder to be cooked. No. It's just a bro me. The bro in me right now is screaming. Yes! Yes! Do y'all know how hard it was to separate 20 egg whites, by the way? It was legit a forearm exercise. Come on, man. Could have at least done me with some pro meal. Come on, bro. Wow, that is absolute depression when you're chasing with coffee when you're eating egg whites and kale. But anyways, just a huge disclaimer here, guys. I'm not going to be eating every single thing on my plate for today's video. I mean, A, I've got type 1 diabetes. I don't want to kill myself. And B, nobody eats like this. This is absolute cap. And I'm not going to waste all this food. You know, I have tons of people in the house right now visiting, so they're all going to be grubbing away at the most bro-ish meals ever. What a great host, I know. This is meal one. I'll show you all the rest of what this diet plan is going to consist of. And you guys for the next meal. All right. 
So, I am outside of the TLF Apparel Training Lab, aka the TLF Apparel HQ, because they're sponsoring today's video, but I'll talk to you all about that in just a moment. First off, we have meal number two in Andre Rush's anabolic 100% natural optimal diet plan. Check it out. We have a peanut butter banana jelly sandwich, which is actually the only normal non-insane thing in his diet plan. By the way, Andre Rush, this is not six percent protein, 20% fat, and 20% carbs, but I'm not complaining here. Thank you for blessing me with this. Oh, man, I'm gonna save this moment right here. Oh my gosh. It doesn't matter who you are in life, it does not get better than this. Like, <laughs> bodybuilder, White House chef, a seal suede, 13 year old child. Oh, no. Oh. Wow, well, I bet he could whip up a mean peanut butter banana jelly sandwich too. I mean, the dude's a White House chef. <laughs> Wow, that was honestly the perfect pre-workout meal. So speaking about pre-workout meal, I'm gonna go ahead inside the TLF Apparel Gym and I'm gonna show you all some super exciting stuff. Y'all are gonna love this. So I just got inside the TLF Apparel Gym and holy hell, this is a legitimate Disneyland for fitness enthusiasts. I'm so excited to be training here, but speaking about being a kid in the candy store, look at all this gym clothes. But look, I'd like to thank TLF Apparel for sponsoring today's video. If you don't know what TLF is, it stands for Take Life further so they sell premium men's and women's fitness and lifestyle clothing and they are such an innovative brand taking fitness clothing to the next level but guys I don't want to tell you about them I'm gonna show you so I'm gonna go ahead try on two different outfits Franklin Grand Theft Auto style three two one let's get it Oh, well, hello there. Check out Franklin's new swag. So check out outfit number one that I want to show you all. So I am wearing the TLF Tactic Tank in olive. And these are the Airflex Gym Joggers in black. So let's talk about the joggers real quick. These are insane. I've honestly never seen gym joggers like this. So they have hidden side pockets for your phone along with some side zippers right on your ankles, which are invisible as well. These are just super light and comfortable, guys. Honestly, my boxers feel heavier than the joggers themselves, which is insane. And then here, the TLF Tactic Tank once again. Again, in olive, which is one of my favorite colors, to be honest. Anything dark, I'm a fan of, but this is super, super st stretchy. It's made out of bamboo and also elastane, which is like the best performance-based blend when it comes to training. So anyways, let's go ahead and switch to outfit number two. In three, two, one. My oh my, Franklin, move out the way. A seal suede has come into play with outfit number two, baby. So check it out. We've got the TLF jersey shirt along with the TLF varsity shorts. So these are super cool. Not only these are very comfortable and breathable. Honestly, I can see myself wearing these outside the gym gym every single day. They will be your girlfriend's favorite pair of shorts, I promise. You're never going to find these things to pick them up. Now, we have the jersey as well, and it keeps you super cool from the side here because it's got a cool mesh along with the stripes on the neck and the armhole, which is super cool in terms of style. And then you have the logo everywhere here in the front. In the back, these guys, this is going to wrap up some of my favorite outfits from TLFapparel.com. Super cool stuff. I'm very proud to be working with such a cool brand that's innovating fitness gear and clothing. Anyways, if you want to pick up some TLF Apparel yourselves like the stuff I just showed you or other stuff on the website make sure you click the first link in the description box down below and you can use the discount code TLF TLF dash a seal to save 15% off your entire order I do appreciate your support and again you're gonna love your clothing tag me on Instagram with whatever you pick up anyways it's borderline torture to be talking this much without getting a lift in in this beautiful gorgeous gym so gonna go ahead wrap up an epic chest and arm session and we'll get back to the kitchen stuffing ourselves with more protein
Ladies and gentlemen, White House chef Andre Rush takes his post-workout nutrition to the next level. We're not talking about no post-workout protein shake here. We have a whole chicken, a whole chicken with just a tiny cup of white rice. We also have a pound of lean ground beef on top of a cup of quinoa along with feta cheese and grape tomatoes. Now, I am combining meal number three with meal number four because this is just gonna take way too long if I'm sitting having one individual meal all day, okay? I'm not trying to be up to like four in the morning eating here, which by the way, Andre Rush probably does do because he sleeps only two hours a day. 12 o'clock midnight, I am going to finish off that other half of chicken. You know, I'll give it to him. Feta, grape tomatoes, quinoa, ground beef. I like it. It's like Mediterranean in a way. I'm Arab, I can say that, right? See my grape tomato bust a nut all over you. Oh, that was you. Oh, this man's tomato just like busted on me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just trying to do my job, get home. I really did you dirty, man. I'm so sorry. <laughs> so where do I even tackle this? Like, where do I begin? It's just <laughs> yeah. We got bands coming out of places I don't even want to know. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna keep that on there. I remember the last time I ate an oven roasted rotisserie chicken straight from the grocery store. I do have to say though, these taste really, really good. And they do come pretty clutch, but they are filled with sodium. So if you do eat these, you know, in terms of like replacing cooking chicken breast because of convenience sake and you're short on preparing chicken breast yourself, uh, just be prepared to drink way more water and up your water intake because they do bloat the hell out of you, just based on personal experience. biceps yet. Hell, this doesn't work. Done. So I just got done preparing meal number five and six because again, I'm gonna start combining these meals together because we have eight massive meals in just one day. And these are no normal meals, guys. They're like over a thousand calories per meal. So anyways, we have meal number five right over here to the side, which is gonna be another whole chicken, a whole freaking roasted chicken. And then we also have a cup of broccoli and then a sweet potato. So Chef Andre Rush does not do the whole chicken, rice, and broccoli thing, okay? It's it's just a whole chicken, potatoes and broccoli. And then we also have meal number six right here to the left of us, which is gonna consist of a 12 ounce piece of salmon and then a very depressing side salad consisting of kale and grape tomatoes. Anyways, guys, wow. I always say this in my videos. There's no way I could get more bro than this, but this, my friends, has topped it to a whole new level. I don't think I could honestly become more of a bro after this video. Like if you have any kind of challenge idea, any Anything at all, please. After you give the video a like, leave it in the comment section down below and we'll see if it gets top requested because you can't. This is as bro as it gets. Oh my god, that salmon though. You can never go wrong with salmon. Highly approved. Highly approved, chef. All right, where do I even tackle this? You know what? We're gonna not eat this like a degenerate this time. I don't even think you can eat oven roasted chicken with just like a knife and a fork. Like you gotta just go straight animalistic, but screw it. It's really dry as hell. It is dry as hell. This just doesn't work. You gotta go hands deep. Raw dog. We're all about raw dog in here. No, we're not. We're not. We're not. No, we're not. Not at all. God, that was so salty. I'm telling you. I cannot get over how salty oven roasted chicken is from grocery stores. Seriously, it's like they pump it with salt. Well, they do. Okay, I spoke too soon. I know exactly how I can get more bro. Check this out. We have chicken on top of salmon. <laughs> oh yeah. my bro. Bro, oh my god. Oh, oh my god. I can't. I just can't. Mm. So before any one of you all decide to purchase a oven roasted chicken breast in a grocery store, or maybe your friend tells you it might be a good idea, or you know somebody that wants to do so, just show them this video because check this out. Look at the bottom of this chicken. What in the world? That ain't natty. What is going down here? That is the ugliest piece of ass <clears throat> I've ever seen in my life. Anyways, show them this video. Help save a life. Help save a bro. Quinoa in the smoothie. Quinoa. Oh my god, I cannot believe I'm doing this. So 
I have just got done preparing meal number seven and meal number eight. We're gonna disregard this for now, but we have meal number seven right here to the right of me, which is going to be a protein smoothie, not just no normal protein smoothie. This is made out of quinoa. Yes, I said it. Quinoa, Greek yogurt, blueberries, a banana, and a scoop of fruity cereal and factory protein butter by my protein, all combined with lovely water. So we're gonna just give this a try, okay? Are you ready? Oh my God, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Thick. That is thick. I do approve of the thickness. Hashtag thick squat. Cheers to the thick squat. Oh, that's not going down. No way, Jose. No way, Suede Wet. No, quinoa, that's all I can taste. Who knew quinoa could be so strong? Anyways, if you're wondering, Seal, what are you doing with this chicken on the very side or edge of the table? Well, guys, based on Insider, literally it says, snack, whole chicken. <laughs> this man has a whole chicken at the end of the day for a snack. So that's my equal of four whole chickens. Look, I really hope you all enjoyed this video, found it fun and entertaining. At the end of the day, I'm not gonna sit and just unproductively eat 10,000 calories worth of protein, but the total Total macros and calories in White House Chef Andre Rush's diet plan consisted of 8,811 calories coming from 459 grams of carbs, 458 grams of fat, and 710 grams of protein. So I literally calculated every little speck of food on the dot, and this is what it came out to be. And he was right about the calorie range. However, I will have to say this is definitely not a 60-20-20 split. I do a 60-20-20. When it comes to 60% of the calories coming from protein, 20% coming from carbs, 20% coming from fat. And in the article on his diet plan, it did mention that he doesn't even count calories and macros, so none of this makes sense. And he doesn't sleep two hours, so he definitely doesn't make any sense. But hope you all enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure you smash the like button right now. And then let me know whatever crazy challenges you can think of in the comment section down below. I'll scroll and see whatever's top requested. Follow me on Instagram at a seal suede to see what I'm up to next. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel if you have not yet already, and hit that notification bell right next to it so you know you don't upload every Monday and Wednesday. You do not want to miss out on epic content to come. And I cannot wait to see every single one of you in the next video.